Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Behind the Bar here at Togo Monero West Hollywood. My name is Sasha, and before we go any further, first of all, wow, Nat City is here. Very exciting. She's a good friend of mine. She's going to help me run through the passion fruit margarita today in honor of National Margarita Day. Uh, and the passion fruit margarita consists of tequila, lime, passion fruit puree, uh, some nice orange liqueur. Very simple, straightforward, very refreshing. Uh, let's get into it. Let's do it. Uh, start with the smaller mixing tin. Excellent job. And we're going to start with tequila. We're going to do one and a half ounces of this. So you grab your measuring tool, the bigger side, and that's going to go to that line right there. Fantastic. Very well done. And we'll put that back and we'll go to lime juice, which you have as well. One ounce of lime juice. That's the smaller side. That's guys. the smaller side. You just fill it up to the top. Well done, straight to the tin. And very well, and we're gonna grab our simple sugar syrup right there, and we're gonna do half an ounce of this one right here. So that'll still go. The smaller side. Yes, that is still the smaller. We're gonna go half to like the halfway line. Like that? Yeah, a little bit more. Okay. There you go. There we go. Right in there. And for my favorite, we're gonna got some passion fruit puree, which you also have right there. Fantastic. We're gonna half an ounce again. Okay. Or you can even sneak in a little bit more if you right? want. I like that passion fruit flavor. Yeah, you can keep it going. Yeah, I like yeah. that. That's healthy. Right in there. Okay. And to finish it off, a little bit of orange liqueur, which I'm just going to add a little bit into there. And then I'm going to give you just the tiniest bit as well. What is that? It's orange liqueur. Ah. Yeah, so it's triple sec for, you know, got it, got us it. common folk. <laughs> yes. And now, we add ice. That's some ice for you. And some ice for me. Then grab the large part of the tin, cover it, give it a good smack, seal it, and now you just have fun with it. There you go. Nice. Fantastic. And then you smack doesn't work. Turn it around. Oh, Maybe go like that and then do it. There ah, you go. Okay. Good job. And then right. we're going to grab our glass. Guess what we're going to do with this? We're going to rim it. Yes, exactly right. So go get that grapefruit. Okay. There you go. Just in and then you're, yep. And then you're going to dip it into the tahini mixed with salt. My favorite ever. Oh, Look that. at that. That is good. Yummy. Good job. So I'm just going to do the same. Excuse me. And then great. We can add ice and we're going to pour the drink. All right, that's some ice for you right there. And grab the strainer, well done, one step ahead of me. And gently just strain it into the glass over the ice. All right. Look at that. And the tahini just like went all in there. Looks good. That is healthy. Even though yours is a little short, I think we'll be okay. We will live. And I'll just put that to the side for you. Okay. And then to finish it off, we got... Why do you smack it? Well, this actually wakes it up in bartending terms. It'll, it'll you know, adding heat releases all the aromas oh, okay. to the mints, yes. And then you want to do me a favor, add a little uh, lime wheel into that for me as well. Make it look nice. Right there. Beautiful. I'm gonna put mine right there. And that's it, very simple, nice. the passion fruit margarita. We can cheers to that. Damn, look at that. That's good.